Hey guys, just a friendly reminder that Come Again TV is not a made for kids channel. All our videos and playlists on this channel are meant for the adult enthusiast and collector. If you're under the age of 13, make sure you click off now. Parental discretion is advised. Welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show. Alright, so here's that Batman Beyond painting I was telling you about. It's a uh, three-dimensional type painting. Kind of. Uh, he did Batman Beyond first. And then he painted the background. It's almost like Batman Beyond in present day. Pretty cool. I've always liked that. Uh, a friend of mine gave it to me. He thought it'd be good as a uh, backdrop for my videos. Which, if you look back at some of my older videos from this past year, uh, you can see it in a few of them. And uh, my family picture right down there. Got taken for the uh, church directory. Now these two paintings here, I know I've shown them off before, but uh, these were done by my friend Danny. Uh, he created the stencils and they're done with spray paint. We got Ghostbusters there. Then we've got Michael Myers there. Pretty cool. And then Amber, who's appeared on a few episodes of the show, earlier episodes, does a lot of beating. And she owns a business called Rated E for Everyone Designs. She did Green Lantern and the Green Ranger. And um, you know what? While we're at it, let's go ahead and take you on a tour of the new studio. Or the uh, new office, anyway. And then we'll take you on a tour of the studio, actual studio. Uh, back here, same friend who gave me that Batman Beyond painting. Did uh, this Ghostbusters one for me. Uh, it's seen better days. I've had it outside for the past year or two. But since we moved, I brought it inside. My Cub Scout uniforms. All right, so the new office. We're still unpacking. Uh, as you can see here, this is my wife's side of the office. Got some Christmas decorations there. I got to unpack. I do plan on do it, reviewing these. I've been wanting to review them for a, excuse me for a while now. They are my wife's. Maybe I'll uh, review them this winter. Uh, she said I could anyway, so there's that. She is a big Minions fan and Doctor Who fan. So that Ecto-1 was actually one of my kids's. They took, them out of, took it out of the package. Uh, but they rarely play with the Hot Wheels, so. All right. And then... Her pops are the ones facing towards the camera. And her action figures. And then the other pops are all mine. The ones on the other side. And all those in the window. <laughs> I've got my secondary monitor in our family room right now until we get a bigger TV. Uh, it's cold out here right now anyway, because this is was is actually a breezeway in between the house and the garage that we decided to turn into the office. So there's no heat coming out here, so we're not really using it for much right now. I just moved this lamp out here for right now to do some uh, toy reviews. There's my pops. Transformers. 
This is the new uh, toy review area and collectible review area, whatnot. Pops, Voltron, Dragon Ball Z. My Batmobile collection. My Disney collection. <coughs> We've got those. And then we got my Green Lanterns. Then my Lantern Cores and Flash. Enterprise. And then G.I. Joe Jet that I found at a garage sale a few years ago. My other action figures. Star Trek. Then we get into my books. We got Mall Lockdown, which I plan on getting to here soon. I got the audiobook of it, uh, plus this one, uh, Star Wars The Force Unleashed, uh, which I believe is the first one. Uh, Lois and Clark, New Adventures of Superman novel. I got at the old book barn a while back. I do plan on doing a review on that soon. Walking Dead, Story of King Arthur, Green Lantern and Philosophy, I Ripper. Then we got some Star Trek novels and Monk. I was at the old book barn a while back, and I actually ended up getting duplicates on this of this on two separate trips. I forgot that I had it and picked it up. My Back to the Future collectibles. Alright. My paranormal books. Video game cartridges. Cards. Then we've got... Ghostbusters. Let's move this chair out of the way so that you guys can see better. Movies and video games. Then. Carnage. Alright, so then let's go ahead and take you out to the studio. Show you the green screen area. <clears throat> I tried ironing out this green screen and uh, didn't work too well. Still uh, working out all the kinks. Still got to unpack a bunch of boxes. We just moved in a few weeks ago. so, And we've only got four lamps. I plan on getting a lot more. Maybe another four. So that's why the green screen's not all that great right now. Uh, in the video I just did with John, you can, when he moves around a lot, uh, his shadow causes the uh, green to pop back out. Here's where we set my laptop while we're filming. And then the camera goes right here. Um, I turned that light on too when filming. Just for a little bit of extra light. So...
go ahead and turn that back off. Shut this door. It's cold out there. I got one of my other backdrops hanging over this window because there's no, it's not a solid window. It's paneled. So, but yeah, there's the, uh, there's a new office. Uh, if you want to see video, a review of these collector sets, let me know. I'll probably do a review of them anyway, once I get around to it. But if you really want to see the review, let me know and I will, I will rush. I will do the reviews right away. So, there you have it guys, from the new office and the new studio. Take care, geeks. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, go ahead and check out one of these two playlists on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Comic Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.